Dilly was a dancing dog. She loved doing her dizzy dances. Some of her dancing was very daring, and some was downright dangerous. Dilly Dog's dizzy dancing led to disaster after disaster. The kids at Alpha Betty's school thought Dilly was a little daffy. They worried about Dilly. At dawn one day, Dilly was doing her usual dizzy dancing. She bounced on her bed as she did a wild dance. Suddenly, she hit the ceiling. Bang! Then she hit the floor. Thud! Dilly! called Daddy Dog. Come downstairs and see what you've done. Dilly Dog felt dreadful when she saw the disaster. A flower pot was damaged. Daffodils were dumped on the floor. I'm sorry, Daddy, said Dilly with dismay. My dancing was a little too dizzy. Oh, Dilly, Daddy replied. I know you adore your dizzy dancing, but do try to be a bit more careful. The next day after school, Dilly danced down to the boat dock. She's a darling dog, whispered Dory Duck, who worked at the dock, but she's a tad dippy. She's definitely a dear, whispered Dory's helper Danny. But she's a tad dotty. Suddenly, Dilly decided to dance on the boat dock. She was not wearing a life jacket, and Dilly was dizzy from dancing. She darted, she dipped, she dove through the air. Be careful, cried Dory and Danny together. But Dilly Dog accidentally danced right off the end of the dock. The water was deep. Dilly was in danger. Without delay, Dory and Danny dove down into the deep, dark water. They dragged Dilly up, up, up. Dilly dog paddled back to the dock. Dory and Danny duck paddled beside her. Daddy Dog came dashing down to the dock. Dilly, you're drenched, said Daddy, and you could have drowned. I'm sorry, Daddy, said Dilly with dismay. My dancing was definitely too dizzy. Dilly, said Daddy, it makes me sad, but I must ask you to stop dancing. Then he bundled her up and carried her home. Dilly Dog was feeling dreadful when she arrived at school the next day. She told Alpha Betty about the disaster on the bed. She told Alpha Betty about the disaster on the dock. Dilly hung her head and cried. Daddy is disappointed in me. My friends think I'm dopey. I'm really down in the dumps. Dilly's tears dripped on her dress. Don't be sad, Dilly, said Alpha Betty. You are a dear little dog. You just need to learn to dance differently. Then Alpha Betty said something that dumbfounded Dilly Dog. Did you know that I used to be a dancer? Alpha Betty asked. No, whispered Dilly. Yes, said Alpha Betty. I can show you delightful dances, dreamy dances, dazzling dances. Would you like to learn? Oh, yes, whispered Dilly. 
Alpha Betty did some dance steps. Dilly tried to do them, too. Some of the steps were difficult. Some were demanding. But Dilly was determined. Dilly Dog danced home that day, but she danced differently than she had ever danced before. She waved to Dory and Danny Duck. They called, Hello, Dilly! You're doing a dandy dance today. Daddy, look, said Dilly when she arrived home. I'm done with dizzy dancing. Watch me dance now. Daddy was delighted with Dilly's new dance. Dilly, he cried, your dance is dazzling. Her smile was dazzling, too. And Dilly never had a dancing disaster again. Well, almost never.